Hey everyone, it's Jess from Meyer Hatchery, and welcome to another episode of Meyer Eats. Today I'm going to show you how to make some super quick and easy chicken cupcakes. You want to start by preparing your pan by adding some cupcake wrappers into your cupcake pan. Next, you want to mix up your favorite cupcake recipe. I'm just using a regular box mix, but you can use your favorite cake mix recipe. After you have your cake mix all mixed up, you're going to go ahead and place that into your cupcake wrappers. Now, for this project, I suggest filling your cupcake wrappers about a third of the way full. This is gonna help create the chicken design we're gonna make in a few minutes here. After my cupcake wrappers are all full, I'm gonna take my pan here and I'm gonna tap it so it evens out the cake mix just a little bit in those cupcake wrappers. After I'm done doing that, I take these little foil balls and we're going to create kind of a crescent moon shape, thinking the top of the chicken and the tail coming up to a point. Now I found that pushing that ball down towards the bottom creates the best shape possible. And again, you wanna make sure that those cupcake wrappers are only about a third of the way full. The foil balls that I'm using are about a quarter to a half an inch thick. You'll kind of get a feel for it as you're putting that foil balls into your cupcake pan there. I like to keep scraps of foil in my drawer just for projects like this. So yeah, something else to add into the junk drawer, but really it becomes really, really useful. After all the foil balls are in place, it's time to bake your cupcakes depending on your recipe. The recipe I'm using here says my cupcakes will take about 20 minutes. And here's what my cupcakes look like all done. You can see we have that really neat kind of crescent moon shape, thinking the chicken head on one side and the tail on the other. To frost my cupcakes, I'm just using a basic white buttercream, but you can get as creative as you'd like when it comes to decorating your cupcakes. That's what makes this recipe so awesome. I start decorating the cupcakes by adding a thin layer of my base frosting and I kind of work my way to the top and I work my way to the bottom or the tail of my chicken. Kind of making sure to leave that center kind of space there where we put those foil balls originally when we were baking. After the cupcakes are all frosted, it's time to do a little bit of decorating. So I'm using just a small circle tip here on my decorating bag with some orange frosting and I'm going to pipe a triangle for the beak of my chicken. You can also use a sprinkle here or you can even use a little piece of chocolate that you've melted into a triangle shape, whatever you'd like to use. After all my cupcakes have their beaks, I'm going to grab some red frosting, again using that writing tip that I had on the end of my decorating bag here, and I'm going to make a comb on the very top of my cupcake, and I just make three bumps, one, two, three, and come down, and then I add a little waddle underneath my chicken's beak. Now I'm keeping my cupcakes very simple. So I'm just doing the comb and the waddle, a beak, and a little eye for my chicken hair. But again, the really great thing about this recipe is you can get as creative as you'd like. Hopefully we've given you some inspiration to make some special chicken cupcakes of your own. If you have any questions, be sure to leave those in the comments below. Be sure to check the description below for a special coupon code that you can use off your next purchase at MeyerHatchery.com. Thank you so much for watching.